Hello and welcome, Dr. Tim Liptrap here in our Principles of Finance class. We are looking at the chapter on risk return in what we call the security market line. In today's exercise, we are looking at portfolio expected returns. That is when you know how much you have invested in stock A or in stock B and stock C and stock D. And then you also know what the expected returns on those stocks are. So what we're looking to do is we are looking to find out what the expected return of the portfolio is. Now that would be in a percentage. That's what we're looking for. So the way that we do this is we find out what the total portfolio value is. We take this number right here. We say 12,650 is invested in stock A and stock 8,450 is invested in stock B. Basically all we do is we add them together. So the total portfolio value in this particular problem is $21,100 when we add those together. So we look at the expected return. We take the 12,650 divided into or divided by the 21,100 and then you multiply it by the 0.08 which is the percentage that that's what the return is valued at. And then we do it again with the 8450 divided by the 21,100 and multiply it by the 0.111 and when you add those two together you get a number 0.0920 or 92 percent. Relatively simple.